during the time of my depression had got really unfit. The opposite of what I'd hoped I'd be after treatment. I wanted to get active again after cancer. It felt like I didn't have anyone around who understood. Though I was feeling really low, I did pick up the phone and speak to Trekstop. I think it was probably one of the best things I'd done. Two weeks before I was due to do the half marathon, but I'd just pulled a muscle or something like that. Um, but it progressively got worse and worse until I was actually like limping around the office. When a nurse saw the leg, she was quite concerned. So she was like, go straight to A&E and get it checked out there. I remember a doctor coming in and saying, it's leukemia. Trek stopped off with me immediately to come to some of their peer-to-peer -peer support groups where I could meet other young people suffering with cancer. As soon as I did, I felt like I had someone who understood immediately what I'd been through, what I was going through. Oh my God, exhausting. <laughs> Absolutely exhausting. It was the most gentle, relaxing stretches and I was exhausted. <laughs> I'm really, really keen to like get my body stronger again. When you go into a normal gym class, the instructor doesn't take time and sit with every single person and go, okay, what's your problems or what's wrong with you? Here, you're understood. You either know that you are going through treatment or you've finished treatment and they know what's to be expected of you and they'll encourage you to do more. <laughs> 